who you work for start talking. Fuck. Fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No, wait. You never, asshole. Now like that! Stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger! I can feel it. Our minds touch on you. I'm like mold on fruit, creeping into you. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Takebura here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Hmm. Why would I do that? Because I am the one who saved your life. Haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. It's hot today. No oh, shit, not good.
NCPD, open up. Barry, we know you're in there. We're here to help. Don't got no fucking warrant. Cut the bullshit. Just open up. We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. We're worried. No. Now leave me alone. Congrats, Mendez. Way to be a prick. Oh, what? So I'm the bad guy? I'm not the one who's holed up playing the attention. Don't touch me. He's not the first or the last. What's going on? I live right upstairs. So keep on living. Stop minding other people's biz. Mendez, hold on. It's his neighbor. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, Patrol. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! Could you check on him when he's chilled down? Sure, why not? Not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just... be patient. Cops falling in rough times can be... touchy. I'll see what I can do. Hey, Barry? Everything all right in there? I'm gonna take that as yes! Try again later. Watch yourself. Ah. Uh. One, two, back it up. Now out of my sight. Punks like, like you, back it me. up. No, All you will. The hell was that mm. for? Yeah, I mean. Hey, B. Haven't seen you in a good one, two, few weeks. <laughs> Figured you'd skip town. Just trouble, usual stuff. Ah, ah. in need of iron and lead, then I take it. Sure. Let me see what you got. All right. Let's see. Soak in that sun while you can. Can't do nothing to me.
Everyone got it out for me. Follow a fly. Mind your damn business, yeah? Get out of my way. What have you got for sale? Only top shelf gear. Yourself? Not anymore. Skull's taking too much of a beating. Reflexes ain't what they used to be. There's ways of fixing that. Karenza cops should do the trick. Rather dish out my eddies for something else. It's time I started taking it easy. You go in the ring yourself?
gonna let me go, right?
sure. Just walk right through me. Who are you? thought you were someone else. Attack! Another attack! suggests coronary implant failure. The remainder of Mayor Ryan's term will be fulfilled by his deputy mayor and closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor in the upcoming election. Today, a molestar a la gente. Sit. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorinobu Arasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma, to be sure, but... She showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? 
<sighs> Sorry, I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose. B, so. wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This cooperation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. Untrue. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that! Shut up! Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she would not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Yorinobu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corpo rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there. Rogue. She take you for a suit? No. She saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. 
Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Helma, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal and make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Problem? Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra skull lining. Absorb 75% of every blow. Miss it, don't you? Ah. Uh... How's Biz going? Uh, can't complain. Corpos learned to keep their distance, and Sokka's back hiring lone mercs. They all gotta have the newest, shiniest implants. Thing you got Misty here to help. 
Handles your griping well. Yeah, renting out her shop's the best decision I ever made. Know what? Seems like you're the only person in Night City who's happy with his lot. You get to a certain age, you drop all your illusions. Life just gets easier from there. Hello there. anything? You forget something? No harm. Chuma mine earned a spot on the menu here. That chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, I was sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. And a splash of love. <laughs> That's right. In the drink's name. A Jackie Wells. Right. Well, the first Jackie Wells is on me. How's the afterlife? Working here, I mean. No real complaints. Fights are rare, and when they do happen, they're over quick. Killer clientele, am I right? Your words, not mine. Could definitely go for a drink. Tough day? Like any other. So, what'll it be? Could definitely go for a drink. Tough day? No. This trouble? The net around me? You won't. You know it. I lost everything through Let you. Let me be plain. Again. Solve your own problems. You Clean up your own else? shit. Go fuck yourself. Be careful who you bargain with. Hey, interested in some work? Doing what? A business opportunity. Cargo transport. Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, then I tell you how to deliver it. Very straightforward. Mm -hmm. Everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. 
Imported and duty-free. Duty-free and detail-free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, No Future. Once you locate it, collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Mm-hmm. Till then, I guess. Rogue? Wanted to talk. It's okay. Hmm. Not here, not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. Don't mess with her, she's got MRIs. See right through. Need your services. Give her. Gotta track a guy down. Mm hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer, worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, T Buck. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. They knew the risks. All sorts of shit happens. To all sorts of people. Even to the best. To you too, Rogue. Arasaka Tower. Remember? Who'd you lose back then? Johnny something? Ah. You came prepped. Of course. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Uh-huh. And if I don't have the scratch, it's fuck off and have a nice day. No. More like come back when you do. Them's the breaks. Mm-hmm. Then, see ya. Soon. You know where to find me. Get you anything? No fucking space. Sorry, sorry. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Yeah. More likely a neuron we aspire for Victor to check out. Or maybe ask them both.
gotta get to a ripper, man. I... Yeah! I'll pay you! Alright. Great! Why are we standing here? <laughs> to the car! Now! Yes, Mr. Stud, XCV-19 series. Yeah, how'd you know? Know my implants, including the black market stuff. Faulty series, got recalled. Still selling it on the street, though. Hey, <laughs> listen, thanks for not laughing at me. Appreciate it. It ain't easy, I'll tell you that. Fuck you. Just our luck. Ah, go, just go, mow him down! Chill, chill. Be gone in a sec. Chill? You tell me to chill? It burns! Fuck, it burns! Chill. I'm doing what I can. What I said to my output, she didn't like that too much. Jesus fucking Christ! You really got to keep yelling like that? You even know how much it hurts? Like I'm screwing a goddamn pencil sharpener! Well, suffer in silence, Chum. Heard what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Real fucking funny. CPD subcons. APB out for suspect accused of organized crime activity near Ross Street and Shipyard Way. Scavengers led by Yelena Sidorova, presumed armed and dangerous, have assaulted multiple homeless persons. Night City officials are offering a reward for neutralizing the threat. Mercy! I did nothing to you! No! I don't want to die! I'm about to become your worst fucking nightmare! Ah! Have us some fun! 
V, you know wild screaming at Tone Tants isn't headline news. Could just be some screamo band set rehearsal? That or something a shade more sinister. Hey, look. Well, well.
okay? Fuck if I know. Motor skills were looking pretty shit, too. Guy with the smoking crotch. That's one way to put it. Anyway, just calling to say I transferred the funds. Thanks. Oh no, thank you. If it weren't for you, I'd. Oof. No problem. Go get him, Tiger. Finish this now.
Okay, I'm back. Talk. Hey! It's, it's me! The guy who... You know. Guy with the smoking crotch. That's one way to put it. Anyway, just calling to say I transferred the funds. Thanks. Oh no, thank you! If it weren't for you, I'd... Oof. No problem. Go get him, tiger.
for that! Loud and clear. Don't need to yell. What's up? Doing a little competition. Shoot. Prizes and all. You know, over here with the range. Oh, so... Uh-huh. That, that'd that make sense. Well, well, you in? Sure. I'm in. When? Well, uh... Right now. We'll wait on you. See ya. Been thinking about a new jacket. What do you recommend? What's it matter? Just pick something. <coughs> it's a beautiful day, huh? Okay, yeah. Totally I'm so sorry. <laughs> hey, Del. How can I be of assistance? What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on gray matter? Nothing extraordinary. It's a complex environment that follows its own set of rules. Seriously? Oh, the term I was looking for was chaotic clusterfuck. Perhaps only a true outsider can appreciate the beauty of its fractal architecture, the structure of life and death here. In my opinion, it is the chaotic elements that give it an advantage. The ability to evolve quickly. Admirer of beauty, are you? When you live among humans, it is essential to find a shared, fundamental point of understanding. Truth and good are values proven to cause division, whereas beauty is universal. I swear I won't do anything to you. Sort of. What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on gray matter? Nothing extraordinary. It's a complex environment that follows its own set of rules. Seriously? Oh, the term I was looking for was chaotic clusterfuck. Perhaps only a true outsider can appreciate the beauty of its fractal architecture, the structure of...
life and death here. In my opinion, it is the chaotic elements that give it an advantage, the ability to evolve quickly. Don't see you as an outsider at all. It delights me to hear a human say that. I've done my best to assimilate. That's your goal, then? To grow and evolve? The world is a process. You never drive on the same road twice. Pardon the expression. You and I, we too are processes. We change as the world around us does. Admirer of beauty, are you? When you live among humans, it is essential to find a shared, fundamental point of understanding. Truth and good are values proven to cause division, whereas beauty is universal. Actually, gotta go. Of course. Goodbye. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. Know where she is? What I just say. Drop it. I won't tell you again. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. You at Lizzie's? What's important? I may have found a solution to the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. That's gonna help us how, exactly? There will be a meeting. You, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me. The truth of events at Kompiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced. But it will be a start. Fine. Where's the meet and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there.
here before. Got a good memory for faces. Here for a good time. Feast your eyes on me. wonder why so even keeps her around. Hey, where are you going? Nothing to see back here. Telling every joy toy you meet to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to me. Moxes and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community. Solidarity. Classic dilemma. What comes first? Family or the outside this is world? A club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Listen. Have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Can you just answer my question? I'm trying to find Evelyn. That's all you need to know. Better start looking then. Black. Seemed to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro. Caught some lead myself, too. Boo hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. The writing's on your face. Okay. Let's just say I'm pretty much fucked. Biochip we clept during the heist is killing me, albeit slowly. Evie commissioned the job. I know how to stop that. That's why I need to know who hired her. Huh. Let's say I believe you. All right. Evelyn's a doll. Used to work at Clouds. I'd look for her there. And where is that? Sig case on my table's got the address. Take it. And once you find Evelyn, give it to her. Mega Tower. <laughs> Luxurious. Just let me know how she's doing, okay? Give you a call, okay? Thanks. Thank you, V. A doll. Why am I not surprised? You're an engram and a fading mind. Nothing should surprise you anymore. So we're gonna hit this place, Clouds? Why the hell not? Staring at. 
Got something to say? Say it. Know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. Might know something more. Evelyn jumped the mock ship a long time ago. And anyone not a mox is not my damn problem. Guessing the club brings in a lot of biz. Pisses its share of cost, too. Why, looking to invest? No, just admiring your operation. We took over this place way back when. Every day I wake up and wonder how it's still standing. We get by, that's all I'll say. Heard you give the working girls a helping hand. That's ancient history. And like all history, it was pretty damn bloody. What was it? Something about a riot? Joy girl murdered by a tiger claw? Not the first, just the one that tipped the scales. Folk went ballistic. Streets overflowed with raised fists. Girls, pimps, outcasts, the whole freak show. It's how the mocks got started. But that's old news. We're running a business now, not a charity. Can't help everyone in this city. Gotta take care of our own. Moxes come first. Forget him. What a Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Yeah. What's up in the Nobody world? can hold a candle to Judy. Cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. My, what a sweet little face you have. Kiss my dead spunk! My, what a sweet little face you have. Bunk. Call me Mr. Hands. If you're looking for Pacifica jobs, call me. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me.
been a long time. Okako Okada, the lady of Westbrook and Seed. When you find them, Westbrook we must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. But you ran a discount yesterday. Drug price on everything. The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. You think Judy's lying? Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? Looking for an Evelyn Parker. She work here? Hmm. Give me a moment. Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Jack in, please. Huh. <sighs> I'm sorry, did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu, let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. Meaning? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. Two matches. Interesting. Is that normal or...? Who can say what is normal? You're clearly a unique person with unique tastes. Our system can handle it. So who will it be, Angel or Sky? Rather go with Sky. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment, and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth 9. Disconnect, please. 
Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. We hope you Sad. enjoy your stay. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Hi, I'm Skye. And you must be... Valerie? V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V, you're dying. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. I was told this place would fulfill my deepest desires. Not what I was expecting this. When true desires go unfulfilled, they turn into needs. We are here to reach for them and beyond. We are here to understand. So what is it I need so badly? To come to terms with the fact that you died. Now move on already. That's tough. Rather let it eat away at me a bit more. Fear of death is what drives us all to do what we do. You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. I just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Death is death is death. You're gone. Game over. You can't know that for certain, even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it. And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. What's past is past. I'm over it. You're in denial, don't you see? Would it change things even by a hair if I wasn't? So what now? Now... ...you find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've... ...you go through Night City knowing a stray bullet. never stopped you from taking action, going where you needed to go, and it won't stop you now. But how do I keep up with everything that's changing? You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then Thanks. Uh, for all this. Jeez. Don't even feel like getting up. Few do. But everything has its end.
afterlife. What's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake. Ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you barge in, violate it, try to rearrange. No. I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you, your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. All right, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. First, tell me what you know about Evelyn. Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think, an XBD star? Where'll I find him? VIP area. Booth two, I think. Thanks. See? You turned out to be useful after all. You're not in trouble. Just want to talk for a little. Where's Evelyn? Need to talk to her urgently. It's important. Well, are you mad at her or something? No. Know where she is or not. Uh, she's not here. Tried calling her more than once. No answer. I don't have time for it. Heard she was chipping a new faceplate in a clinic in Osaka. No, no. Oslo. That was it. Evelyn tell you personally she was going away? Um, no. Just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left. Like I said. Woodman? Who is he? Mr. Forrest. But we all call him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay. Mr. Forrest, then. Who is he? Um, he's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dull. Yeah, Rio. 
So how's this all work? An algorithm pilots the doll's motor functions. It takes your profile data and transforms into experiences in real time. Memory dampers on the doll's behavioral chip block any recall of the session. So there'll be no trace of the meeting. Well, I could say yes, but that would strip it of mystery and suspense, wouldn't it? Once you're in there, you set the stakes. You're saying it's not dangerous, but there's some risk involved. That is one way to put it. One thing is for sure. You never get what you expect. Consider my interest peaked. Am I... I...
B. Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show. Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing.
Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show. Man can only dream. The skull sponges and these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. B. Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show. Man can only dream. Finally! The real action! 
Tiger Claw's moonlight is peeping Toms. Always got eyes on their dolls. Know what goes on in these booths. Then, data mine the behavioral chips. Saw that twist coming a mile away. Had a hunch? Still, wonder if it's for their own use or for sale. And who'd be buying?
are you? What do you want? Chill. Keep calm. I'm looking for a girl. Okay, Cap. Interesting word choice for someone who plowed through, massacring all along the way. Things got out of hand, I'll admit. But cooperate, and no one else will get hurt. I don't negotiate with terrorists. You're the queen of fuck-ups. You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless eyes? Or scour his cop? That just might work. Sold her off to a ripper. Chip was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy you Toy's wet dream. Let's take a look, shall we?
fresh, not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. Well, the client wasn't the one who flew off the handle. Something bitter in the ass. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. And that runner? Weird. Nice work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? Pink Fingers has got her. Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Pink Fingers has got her. Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Don't have time to massage egos. I respect that. Of course you do. You'd have loved to drop an H-bomb on this place. No need to go so OTT. I've got other methods. One thing's for sure, though. Claus won't forget this. fell flat. Now you're flat. Don't look in any condition to find help. <laughs> 
The hell's that? No, 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 no. Damn, it. damn it. Jesus, the fuck do you want from me? It's all going too slow. Gonna decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live you now. already. What the hell you want from me? I gotta get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. That's... Never. Okay. Oh. Fall. Sure. Ex Stop. Enough. This I'm... For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Bakoshi.